guys, it's me, Mike. Welcome back to Unbox Warehouse. Today on the table, we're going green because we have a seven watt solar paneled USB charging device. This is supposed to charge phones and USB devices with the sun. This is the Nomad 7 Plus. This product is by Goal Zero, and I'm not gonna lie, it's a little steep. It's about a hundred bucks for this solar panel, but if you're in an area that you don't have electricity, this might be the option for you. If you're living off the grid, if you're a conspiracy theorist, if you like camping, whatever it is, you might wanna have one of these in your bag. Smart charging for phones. It has intelligent electronics that has a solar intensity indicator that gives you an indication of how much power is coming from the sun. And this thing has a USB output you can plug your phone directly into. Rugged waterproof constructions means that you always have power, no matter what conditions you're in. It says it'll charge a phone in only two hours with full sun. Now, I have an extra Note 8 that I'm gonna run bone dry, and then we're gonna try this thing out and see how long it actually takes to charge a Note 8, which is a pretty hefty battery for a cell phone, but let's put it to the test. The outputs are a USB port, five volts up to 1.4 amps with a seven watt max power output. So. Pretty good. We'll see if it lives up to the hype. I haven't even seen it yet. This is the first time. Oh, this is this is already interesting. And on the back, it's got a zipper full of goodies. What is in here? Now I'm curious. That pouch is really tight. It's hard to get your fingers in there. Looks like they give you a little gold carabiner here. That's nice of them. In case you wanna attach this to your bag, two of them. I feel like there's some magnets going on here. Yup. This is cool. This little flap here is magnetic. So if you wanna point it at the sun, you can just pull that little flap out. It's very stiff, super stiff. It's so stiff it won't even stay open. It just shows it opened right up real simply but when I open it in real life, it just, it won't stay open. Maybe I need to, maybe we need to break it in a little bit. Let's bend it the other way. Okay, that's way better. So you might have to bend this thing backwards a little bit to get it to sit normal. And then coming right out of the back of this thing is a standard USB cable. So I live in a big city in Florida. I got plugs everywhere. Plus it's supposed to be cloudy for the next few days. I really don't have a need for this, but I do know the perfect place. My dad owns some land in Texas that is desolate. I mean, there's cactus and stuff there. Is it cactuses? There's cacti, cacti over there, okay? This is the perfect place to test this. So let's head to Texas, finish this review. So we're out here in South Texas, in Beeville, Texas. We're out here in a little more desolate of an area than we are at the studio in Florida. So this is the perfect place to test the Goal Zero Nomad 7. Um, it's a beautiful sunny day right now. So I have a Note 8 here that is completely dead. And we're gonna use the Goal Zero Nomad 7 to see how long it takes to charge this. We have a perfectly sunny day. I got a stopwatch and we're gonna plot it out, see exactly how long it takes to charge. Now, this little indicator here with these blue lights, this tells you how much sun you're getting. So right now we have four blue lights. That means we're getting full sun. If you block this, you'll see you lose the sun. So that lets you know if you're getting full power out of the goal zero. So you can see we're at 1% right now. So I just plugged it in and it is charging and we're at 1%. We'll check this thing again in half an hour. So the first 30 minutes has gone by and we are at 8%. So we just reached one hour charging the Note 8 on the Goal Zero Nomad 7 and we are at, let's see, 18%. That's pretty good for an hour of zero battery, just using the sun. Let's check it out in another 30 minutes. 
So here we are at an hour and a half and the phone is at 26%. Not bad for an hour and a half. I did have to shift the angle of it a little bit because the sun has moved. I had to move it about 10 degrees. So not bad at an hour and a half. We'll see you at two hours. So we got the charger going. I'm gonna go kayaking with the family for a minute. Um, I'm gonna let my assistant take these readings and when the phone hits 100%, we'll go over the results uh, of the Nomad 7, okay? All right, we're at 99%. We're gonna go ahead and call that good. The Goal Zero Nomad 7 Plus charged the Note 8, which has a large battery, in six and a half hours to 99%. And there's the chart. We were averaging about 8% every half hour, I'd say, and it got up to 99% in six and a half hours. All from the sun, but we're running out of sun. So there you go, the Goal Zero Nomad 7 Plus charged a Note 8, which has a large battery in like six and a half hours. Not bad for completely off the grid charging. No battery needed. This thing is extremely rugged. It's such a cool design. It is kind of hard to stay open sometime because the material is so stiff. But other than that, if you bend it backwards a few times, it will stay open. What a great concept. This is something great to keep in a boat with you, keep in your RV, anywhere where you might need electricity and you don't have a battery bank. No one wants a dead phone. So I'm gonna put a link below if you'd like to get your hands on one. Also, check out one of these videos right here and don't forget to subscribe and please hit that little notification bell so you can get notified next time we open something right here on Unbox Warehouse.